My first year selling on Amazon all in arbitrage, I made over $100,000 in profit. But using AI, I could have doubled that and my students are proof. We'll pop a whole bunch of student results up here on screen. No buying stuff from China, no marketing, no guesswork. In this video, I'm revealing the exact AI strategy we use to find winning products even if you never sold before in just 10 minutes. And unless you hate saving time and making more money, shut everything else off and lock in on this video. Let's jump inside my screen. All right, guys, let's find some winning products in just a couple minutes. So to start off, we're here in ChatGPT, so goaded for Amazon FBA. And I wanna start off with the simple prompt. I'm a new Amazon seller focusing on online arbitrage. What are some small, typically auto one gate brands in beginner friendly categories like clothing, beauty, and personal care? If we go ahead and search this on ChatGPT, we can see it's spitting out a bunch of ideas here. Time and True, I found profitably before. George, I found profitably at Walmart here. We can see Stafford saying JCPenney, commonly auto one gated here. So we can see all these different ideas of brands. Now I want to figure out where this is actually coming from. So saying Stafford specifically comes from JCPenney's, just to further validate this guy's look, you can literally do for any brand, I'm gonna go here and say, does Stafford only come from JCPenney website here? Let's see. So we can see it says Stafford is not exclusively available through JCPenney website, but it is a private label brand owned by JCPenney, in which case it makes sense. It's pretty much always gonna come from JCPenney, at least at the cheapest price possible, even if it technically is available elsewhere. So now I know that Stafford and those other good brands have showed our potential opportunities to look into. And I know that Stafford primarily comes from JCPenney's, but I don't just want to go look there for no reason. I'm going to ask the AI, is there a sale going on on Stafford products at JCPenney's right now? Because it's Memorial Day going on. And luckily for us watching this video right now, Father's Day, 4th of July, Prime Day, and back to school season are all fast approach, which is going to mean a lot more good deals. And a lot of you guys are already using AI. You're just using it incorrectly. And what I'm about to show you guys finding winning products is just one small example of how to use AI to aid in your Amazon journey. So if you stick around at the end of this video, guys, I'm going to give you guys access to the Profit Prompts Pack, which is a detailed collection of some of my favorite prompts every Amazon seller needs to be using to maximize their sales and profits in as little time as possible. Coming back to GPT here, guys, we're going to say, is there a good deal on Stafford right now? Because it's Memorial Day. So let's see. And it's saying here, guys, yes, JCPenney is offering significant discounts on Stafford men's apparel products during their Memorial Day sale right here, 25% off with the code HONOR as well. And not only is there a good deal going on on Stafford now, but I'm also going to ask AI guys is go here and say, does JCPenney have good discounted gift cards here? Because that's another way I can go ahead and lower my buy costs. Boom. And we can see here, guys, yes, you can find JCPenney discounted gift cards real easily through on Carbear. We can see up to 9.6% off. So now we know JCPenney has a good deal and using discounted gift cards, I can go ahead and lower my buy costs even further, just buying discounted gift cards and using the codes to check out on the website. This is a really good way to to lower your buy cost and create more margin. So now we used AI to identify good reseller friendly brands, even auto one gate ones, where they come from and different discounts we can use to make them good. Now guys, I'm literally just gonna come in here and think to myself, okay, how can I find the best performing products in a specific brand? And luckily the best way to do that is actually the most simple, literally just coming here on Amazon and searching Stafford here and we just type in like Stafford men's and now pretty quickly, the best consumer facing algorithm literally on earth is gonna show us a bunch of products here that people are already buying on Amazon, which is the exact type of stuff we wanna sell as Amazon all in arbitrage sellers. So I'm not gonna worry about like these sponsor listings here. And now we can go ahead and keep opening up these listings, guys. And now we're just gonna cross reference over to JCPenney and see what makes money right here. And this is such a simple method. It's called like leaf sourcing. And it just is really, really effective here. So we can see starting off $33 in the buy box right here, 200K sales rank, 50 estimated sales per month here. Taking a look down here on the Keepa chart, we can see super, super stable price as well. All we have to do, guys, is just go ahead and Google this product here. Now we can see over on the JCPenney website here, guys, 1575 here. That's looking pretty close to being profitable here. So we take a look at here and plug this in on Selleramp so we can see. So 1575 here, 1575. And remember, guys, we have those discounted gift cards as well. So now I can take off 9% from this using those card bear discounted gift cards here. And now $4.50 profit, 32% ROI. And it is so simple to just use these ChatGPT prompts to go ahead and find opportunities to take a look at as long as there's a good deal going on. So now this is profitable. What I also want to do is see what other sizes potentially look like this as well, which I could go down here on the variations tab on Keepa to identify looking like probably not the case on these other ones. We need them closer to like 30, 31 to make sense here. We can see 
good winning ace in there. Let's keep it moving, guys. Right, so coming over this one, we'd see competition's trending up on this. Not a huge fan. The price is pretty steady here, so we can give this a quick Google search. Probably doesn't work here. We can see, yeah, 22.5. Take off those discounted gift cards right there. We can see, yeah, just about break even, so I don't like that. Right, we can see, taking a look at these guys here. Go down to variations see what's you know moving for the most expensive right here as well we can see there's a going for 38 bucks right here might even be trending up a little bit yeah people buy box a little closer to 40 here so let's see so we're here at yeah 38 bucks here then we'll just go ahead and google this see what jc penny's got it for right here so we can see at 22.5 22.5 take off those discounted gift cards right there we can see close not quite there no problem. Let's keep it moving here. Let's see these t-shirts. Go down here to variations. And Lou, you can run this play and you can use these examples of stuff we found as winning procs to go ahead and storefront stock off of as well too. So we can see those guys don't quite work right here as well. Take a look at these guys here. Yeah, boom, money right there. So we can see taking a look here let's see here so we can see yeah 39 let's see 39 here so we can see this is either going to be close or pretty good here so let's see so 24.75 right here 24.75 taking a look at that take off nine percent from this we can see not quite there honestly though if you're a beginner this is totally good here it doesn't quite hit that 30 percent roi criteria but six stars profit nice and consistent over time right here we can see price is super stable people buy box and higher too close to like 39 and 40 right there we can see that's not bad at all we can take a look at the variations here too and even though the competition was going up a little bit on that we know this deal is going to end soon so there's probably not going to be a ton of additional competition that gets on it as well so we can see taking a look at these guys too go down here to variations as well right so we can see dang 36 bucks here competition's going up on this but we can see this could still totally make sense though right here as well so we can see these four pack boxers right here so let's see yeah four pack boxers here at 1912 right so we can see yeah, boom, four pack boxers in the blue color right here, 19.12, close. And then guys, remember we take off those discounted gift cards, now it becomes good. So $7 profit and a 41% ROI right there. Even though the competition is going up a little bit here, if we take a look historically, we have a lot of profitable history on this and the competition has gone down a substantial amount. Then we always wanna take a look at those other variations too to see if any of these other ones make sense. And then you can go ahead and use these prompts to make money and storefront stock off these winning products too as well. And what I like about about this variation specifically is it's an FBM buy box. So I know I'll be able to price higher, probably about like 10% higher here. So if we plug in like 10% and add on to this, we're here taking advantage of what's called the prime bump here. We're getting close and these white ones here at 19.12, go ahead and take off 19.12 minus those discounted gift cards here. Now this listing becomes good. And that's exactly how we can harness AI to find a lot of winning products fast. So I hope this video was helpful. You really need to be using AI for the stuff. I'll leave the link down below in the description where you can get completely free that big list of prompts for Amazon sellers. My 10 favorite prompts that'll make life a lot easier for you, especially if you're a new seller. And if you ever want personalized one-on-one -on -one help directly from me implementing this stuff, guys, the first link in the description is gonna be my coaching program application where I've helped guys like Abe sold over $3 million before graduating high school. My man, Nick Spizak right here, quit his nine to five job after a few years of making six figures profit part-time as a busy father of two. And my boy, Dylan right here, transitioned from doing real estate full-time to becoming a full-time Amazon seller in less than a year, going from zero to 200 grand a month in sales. So if you want personalized one-on-one help directly from me, I'm the only Amazon coach that actually does one-on-one -on -one sourcing calls with all my students. Take a look down below at the link in the description. If you have any questions, let me know down below in the comments. Make sure to subscribe for more and I'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks so much for watching.